video here on Toy Transformations. We are so excited because today we are going to transform our LOL dolls into one of our favorite couples, Marinette and Adrian from Miraculous Ladybug. Impressive, Marinette. You all picked the wrong side. They are super cute, so we are really excited to see how our LOL dolls turn out. So let's begin. Here's our first LOL doll ball, so let's remove the first layer to discover the secret message. And here it is! Oh, what could this mean? There's a face with sunglasses and a nice cube. Oh, it means cool and size. Love it! We are now removing the second layer of our LOL doll ball. Here we are going to find the sticker. I love all the things LOL dolls can do. They are amazing. And here it is. It says that our LOL doll can either cry, spit, tinkle or change color. Okay, so now the third layer. And here's our first secret bag. Let's open it and... <gasps> here's a baby bottle! This one is a white one with a light brown stripe and a cool silver cap. Now onto our next layer. We found our next secret bag. So let's open it. This is the bag that contains our LOL doll shoes. And... Oh, wow! Look at these cute white boots with yellow soles. Do you guys have any idea of the doll we are going to get? Here's our final layer! It's so exciting! Here's another of our secret bags. This one has the outfit of our LOL doll. Let's open it and... Oh, this is such a little cute outfit! With a pink shirt and white vest that matches just perfectly with that pleated skirt. I could even wear this myself. So dreamy. We can finally open our bowl that contains our LOL doll. And here are all of the remaining secret bags we have. First, there's a catalog. I love seeing all of the different dolls I can get. It makes me so happy. Okay, it's time to open this secret bag and... Oh my god, look who we got! It's a snow angel from the Chill Out Club. She's super cool. Let's open our last secret bag. Mm, let's see... Earmuffs, awesome! Okay, so here's Snow in your old dress. She looks super cute, don't you think? I really love how the skirt looks. She's going to look adorable as Marinette. So now, guys, let's begin! We're going to transform our cute snow angel, but first we have to choose a more fitting outfit so she looks just like Marinette. So we chose this super duper cute black and white lace dress and we will cut the bottom part to make it look like Marinette's jacket. And also we chose these golden flats. Transformation time! Snowball's hair bones are so cute, but we will need to cut them off. So let's cut them off very carefully. And we are gonna cover up the hole on the doll's head with a small piece of blue tape. And then we will be able to model Marinette's hair. Once we cover the hole with blue tape, we are going to take a small amount of air dry clay and so we start modeling the first part of Marinette's hair. I'm having so much fun! Now the first part of the hair is done. Let's add some texture. With a thick needle, we'll draw lines on the front in a way that makes it look like Marinette's bangs. And after, we'll also model and attach the pigtails and add extra details on the hair. Now, with a rectangular piece of clay, we will wrap it around the doll's leg and start modeling Marinette's jeans with the help of this modeling tool we have. We will use this navy blue color on our LOL doll's hair. We apply the color evenly with this thin brush. I really think Marinette's hair color is lovely. Marinette's jeans are going to be a bright pink like a flamingo. Let's paint it really good and make sure there aren't any unpainted spots. For the bottom part of the jeans, we are going to use a very thin brush and paint it white. It's looking good so far. Let's paint the other side with white paint and we will also add some other details on the jeans such as the pockets. Here I took a small amount of pink with my modeling stick and with that we are going to add tiny dots on the bottom of Marinette's jeans. These jeans are so pretty! To create Marinette's jacket we are gonna cut off the bottom part of our LOL dress. It's going to look perfect! So here's how it looks after cutting it. Now with a nail file we're gonna remove the bows our shirt has. We don't want them to stand out because Marinette's outfit doesn't have any bows. 
With this thin brush, we will paint our cute shirt all white. This is how the color we are applying next stands out. We'll use a super thin brush and with black paint we are going to design Marinette's jacket. Remember to leave the middle section white because that's Marinette's shirt. Good job! So now with a tiny bit of pink and blue paint we'll add the flowers on Marinette's shirt. I love how awesome it's looking! Now we'll paint tiny spots on the sleeves to make it look cuter. Marinette's outfit is really sweet, don't you think? Let's apply a layer of clear nail polish on our doll's eyes. This way they are gonna look super shiny and cute. We didn't have to paint our LOL doll's eyes because she already had them blue like Marinette. Our LOL doll has this cute little mole on her lip, but we will have to remove it using a cotton swab and some polish remover. Let's paint our golden flats all beige. I love painting tiny LOL accessories, it's so much fun. Now with a very thin brush and black paint, we will add some details on the shoes, like the shoelaces. It's looking so adorable. Our LOL doll transformation is complete. Wow, she looks just like Marinette. I love how it looks. Marinette is one of my favorite superheroes. She is honest, brave, and super sweet. Adrian must have gotten his gift by now. What's that you said? Mm -hmm. I can't wait to get back to school this afternoon. And our LOL dolls look super stunning. Don't you think? I'm so happy with the result. Okay, guys, here is our second LOL doll bowl. Let's open the first layer and here we'll find a secret message. Oh, let's see, let's see. It's a lollipop and a lemon. Wow, and it means sweet and sour. So cool. Now let's open the second layer of our LOL doll bowl. I love opening LOL doll bowls, so exciting! And here we found our collectible sticker that says our LOL doll can either cry, tinkle, spit or change color! Here we are on the third layer! Let's open it to find out what we will get next. Here's our first secret bag. I wonder what's inside. Let's open it and... <gasps> wow! These are super duper cute sunglasses. They are heart shaped. We're almost done. Let's open our next layer. Here's the secret bag and let's open it to find out the little shoes we got this time. And... <gasps> wow! These are some awesome white boots but one of them has a red part. <gasps> so fashionable. Finally, our last layer. Let's open it and look inside our last bin. Here's the secret bag, so let's open it. Uh, oh, oh, we got another pair of sunglasses. These ones are red retro ones. I love them. Now let's open the bowl. First, let's take out all of the secret bags that are inside. And here's our LOL Dolls catalog. I want to collect them all. Let's open this bag first and... Oh, we got this super stylish and awesome purse. It has a heart with bat wings on it. I'm opening this bag now. So exciting. And... Oh, wow, look at this, guys. We got a little sister doll instead of a regular LOL doll. This is super rare. This cute little sister is Little Spice. She looks so adorable with that red pacifier. Okay, so now let's open our last secret bag and... Oh my god, I can't believe this! We got another little sister! This one is Lil Sugar! Guys, I'm super confused right now! Had any of you guys have had this happening to you before? Please let me know in the comments down below! So guys, here's all the things our LOL doll bowl had inside. This is the first time something like this happens, because the LOL doll we opened was a regular size LOL, but we got two little sisters instead. I feel super lucky, but also curious about what happened. Aren't you feeling curious too? It was a big surprise. Unfortunately, these little cuties won't work for our transformation, so we'll open a third LOL bowl. Okay, here's our third LOL doll bowl. Let's start opening the first layer. Here's our secret message. Oh, let's see. It's a cup of tea and a party popper. It means tea party. I love parties. Now let's remove the second layer of our LOL doll bowl. Okay, let's open it and... Here we find our collectible sticker. It says that our LOL doll can either cry, spit, tinkle or change color. So cute. 
Here's our third layer. Let's open it and here's our first secret bag. Let's open it. I hope we get something really cute. Oh, it's a baby bottle. This one is a white one with light blue cap. Let's open our next layer now. We're opening our next layer. Let's take out the secret bag and let's open it to see what we got. And wow, it's a pair of cute black and white shoes. So adorable. Here's our final layer. Let's open it and let's open the next secret bag we found. What will it be? Oh, wow, this is a super awesome dress. This dress looks like something out of Wonderland. I would totally wear this myself. Now we finally open our LOL doll bowl. Here's everything that was inside. First, let's open this secret bag and... Oh, yes, one of my favorite ones. She's curious cutie. I really love how she looks. Okay, now let's open the next secret bag. Here's Curious Cutie's headband. It has a big black bow. Perfect. And finally, here's our LOL catalog. How many of these dolls do you already have? So here's our LOL doll wearing all of the cute items we got from our bowl. She looks just too adorable. She is rocking that Alice in Wonderland look. It's transformation time! We're gonna transform Cutus Cutie into the super cool and popular Adrian. But first, we had to choose a more fitting outfit. So we chose this pink and white jacket and the shoes we got from our second LOL doll ball. I'm sure it's gonna look super amazing. The first step is to cut off our LOL doll hair bones. As you can see, the bangs are super similar to Adrian's. So we are going to use that. We will just cut off the bones off. Once we've cut the hair bones, we're going to cover up the holes with a piece of blue tape so we can start modeling Adrian's hair. For Adrian's hair, we're going to use a small chunk of foam, but we won't cover the bangs this time. We'll just cover the back part of the head and modeling into some spiky hair, just like Adrian's. Wow, the hair looks super good! We will just add some more spikes onto the hair with the small pieces of foam. Okay guys, let's start modeling the jeans by wrapping a small chunk of air dry clay and with the help of our modeling tools, we'll make the jeans look super awesome. Let's start painting the hair. We're going to paint it with a golden blonde color. I love how spiky Adrian's hair is. He is so cool. The hair looks good. Now with a white brush like this one, let's add some highlights on Adrian's hair with a shiny gold paint. I love the effect it gives to the hair. Awesome. Now with blue paint, we are going to start painting his jeans. Make sure you don't leave any unpainted spots. Okay, here's the top part of the outfit we chose. And we'll cut the sleeves to make them shorter. I'm sure this shirt is gonna look good. We are going to paint this shirt so it matches Adrian's shirt. Our shirt has these small wrinkles on it. So we will cover them with a small piece of foam to make it look straight. With a thin brush and white paint, we are going to paint the outer part of the shirt. This section in the middle will be painted black. With another small piece of foam, we'll model the neck piece of the shirt to make it look even more similar to Adrian's shirt. We will paint the neck piece we added with the same white color we used for the outer part of the shirt. I love it! So finally, let's paint the middle part of the shirt using a thin brush and black paint. I think this shirt is looking really nice. Now, with a super thin brush and yellow, green and purple paint, we will add some stripes on the black part. Little details are super important. We are going to paint the shoes with this super bright orange color. We won't paint the soles of the shoes, we are going to leave them white. Now, with a cotton swab and polish remover, we are gonna erase the face details like the eyelashes and the lip paint. He is looking handsome. Adrian's eyes are green, so we will paint our LOL doll's eyes with green paint. Okay guys, so now with a very thin brush, we will put gold paint on Adrian's belt. He looks super. Let's add a layer of clear nail polish on the eyes to make them look super, super shiny. And here's Adrian, guys. He is the most popular boy in the whole school. Even Marion has a crush on him. You okay? Nothing broken? Uh, yeah, uh, I'm fine. He's super cool and super brave too. He is an awesome superhero. This LOL doll looks super awesome as Adrian. Did you guys like it? 
So here's one of our favorite couples, Marinette and Adrian. I really love how these transformations look like. They look super cute, so romantic. I think the details of the hair look awesome. So this was today's transformation. If you enjoyed this video as much as I did, please like, subscribe and share this video. Ring the bell to get notification from all of our next videos here on Toy Transformations. Thank you so, so much for watching. We love you guys. See you soon. Bye, bye, bye. Bye.